Alright. So. I guess I'm gonna Wherever in this world I roam, I carry uh, memories of my home. This blade. It is the last link I have to the land of my birth. Mm -hmm. uh, This one, I don't even remember which one exactly that one was. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Random image. Let's nip that in the butt. And shroud. I got careless. Wind strider. Gather. Huh? Then it's time to fight with you. And now we may enter this one. Maybe we should as well. Uh, let me spend one for day. Eh. I don't think I've seen a blue one so far. Oh. Nara. Don't be afraid. We are not bad, Nara. Paimon Paimon, Insignus. You are our recon, right? We're friends of our Nara. Araja sent us here. That's right. We come. We've got some questions. Oh, there's me, strange Nara around. That's why I was a bit scared. He has a surge. Uh, we didn't mean to scare you, it's just that we didn't know you were so absorbed in... Hmm. Since you can see our Rikan and our friends with Havarja, the Force must recognize you. You can't be bad, Nara. Uh, you are good, Nara. Our Rikan is not afraid. You Did you say you have questions for our Rikan? That's right. Why are we out of focus? We could, we would like to know more about the delicious fungus. We would like to know more about this suspicious Nara around Vimara village. The one. <coughs> the Oregon will have a bit of a throw. Arana is good Arana, protecting Vana often. And helping little Nara always. I will, well, I will not do this. Aurika wants to help the little Nara. Arana said that Marana's avatar is taking little Nara away. Avatar. So Aurika's helped. Recently, the local Vana, uh, I mean the forest, 
The force and stream are always crying. Maybe it's because of Marana. Marana bad. Why are we still out, out of focus? What happened? Uh, Marana refers to the return and Vanna that's gotta mean the forest. Well, people told us that for us already a lot of times. The previous question they never questioned it. They knew what it was. Uh, that's some new Arnar words learned. No. Wait, does the forest cry too? Maybe it's a figure of speech. Maybe it's something only Arnar can hear. It cries very loudly. Mm, the sunshine brings happiness, but too much sunshine means less water. Water makes us grow, and the water means withering. Uh, songs uh, uh, bring happiness and power. Getting sick makes us upset, and being sick for too long means withering. And it's the same for Vana and Aranara. But mint is different, mint so strong. I think attention, there's like meat in the desert or something. The forest has been crying harder lately. Our Arikan is worried. Uh, is it because Maran is harming the forest? Arikan is not sure. It smells like Manara, but not really the same. But Arikan knows that some bad, dirty stuff are making the forest sick. In places Arikan can't see. If the forest keeps getting sick, being sick like this, a super giant Marana will come around to suck all the living things away. Uh, all the flowers will wither and all the leaves will fall. The fruits will go bad and mushrooms will stop growing. And no more mushrooms. That means no more chicken mushroom skewer. Uh, I heard you look into the suspicious now. Or you can know. Around the area of the sickness, there is a weird Nara that might be the bad Nara you want. Looks like we can help each other. What are you thinking? That's exactly what I'm thinking. Thank you, but my runner is scary. Nara will die. Without that bar, we will be alright. Nara is defeating my runner before. You're very strong. And you are Golden Nara, just like the legendary Nara Varuna. You look reliable, so I believe in you. Just leave it to us. Now we got another question. Our reward. Uh, tell me about the super bad, super dirty stuff. I see many weird Hilinara. Ah, oh, that's a new word. Uh, that's nice. Uh, with filthy stains on them. Uh, they've been acting suspiciously around the giant Arrow Mountain. Hilinara. Giant Arrow Mountain? You mean the super big ruined guard, guard over there? Speaking of which, didn't we see a similar machine earlier? We, we did? I mean, I, I did, but the desert was supposed to be after this. Wasn't it? I don't think it was called a ruined golem or something. But this big guy looks a little different. He has no eye. They are talking about the one from the desert. Wasn't this quest supposed to be unlocked before? Yeah, that's true. The other ring golem we've seen have a core that looks like an eye, just like ring guards. I didn't pay that much attention to their face, but it like the same. Arika knows nothing about the any ring golem. As for the giant iron mountain, it has been here since a long, long time ago. A long, long time? How long is that exactly? A time. The time it takes for a tiny little seed to grow into a giant tree that can touch the sky. Hmm, that sure is a long time. Long, long time. Well, it shouldn't be hurt in the forest if it has been there here for so long. The people might come here because of it, though. Who knows, it might revive itself at some point. I hope it's not. Either way, let's investigate, shall we? Who knows, we might even find some treasure. Thank you. Arika also saw that there are other strange things besides the suspicious Nara. Alright then, let's go. Don't fall behind now, Arika. Alright. Uh, One with the forest! Uh, 
Nothing here. Scraps. Yeah! <laughs> Can't see. Keep up. This connection between space and their stuff. The name says, You hear strange that come from blow. Huh? Ah, <laughs> uh, explore over there. <laughs> and this is like. Sh I should be able to pass through here. Hmm, I've been here. Uh, I think one of those stabilize time trials. So, um, God. Let's nip that in the butt. Just like we rehearsed. I will have order. Wind strider. Fallen leaves. Adorn my. Hi. Follow the wind. that? Service note. It seems to be a page torn from a research log, perhaps because it was relevant. Uh, the paper is covered in moss and the contents have long ceased to be whole. Explore the jungle with Zendik. Uh, its local biodiversity is impressive. Although the growing effects of the withering in other areas have also affected this place, it has yet to pose a great threat. We discovered a few new microscarp species. I suppose I could name them Nahidat scarabs. Uh, the name Nahida means small or something, which means 
a Dendro Archon Spoon. Uh, uh, the, the word scarab is part of that, or just Nahidad? Is a uh, good name, I say. Zendik was attracted by the ancient machines left behind by some civilization here. He's young, handsome too, but he's too rich, and the research approach of his darshan has nothing in common with Amurta. As a result, we have nothing to talk about even though we are exploring this place together. That's pretty annoying. Zendik and I discuss the traits of local plants and animals. We also exchanged views of their evolution models. We had a great time and decided to go on a picnic tonight. That doesn't sound like they don't don't have anything to talk about. There are leaves around, and I know. That's one is a marks on the map. This one's a marks on the map. Let me place uh, something. So I just don't the tune to accompany them, if you wish to hear it. Don't get lost looking for leaves. Once it gets added to the map. Oh, I'm gonna die afterwards. Is that one of those? Come on, have I hit you? Oh. There was another one over there. It's a part of the same. Yeah, they're moving very good. They don't show up from one with the forest. Um, uh, that's easy. Come on, how many do I have to hit here? Seems so. Damn. Oh. So that. I just wasn't close enough.
Time to go. Who says there aren't benefits to a life of wandering? Oh, there's one here as well. Oh, there's a guy here. That's a suspicious Nara, quick. Uh, how did you get here? Alright, Ignos, that's a suspicious Nara. He's being sneaking around here with that suspicious machine. Hmm, you're right. Coming to a place like this is pretty suspicious, alright? Uh, I'd say you're the suspicious ones here. After all, I am a certified researcher from the academia. And you are the uh, you are outlanders of honor origin. You've been commissioned to investigate this place. Oh, a commission, so you're adventurers. Or perhaps you are air mines or something. Well, it doesn't matter. My name is Jazari. Uh Shar Sharwar Sharwar. Kisharwar. I don't know. Researcher, as you can see, yeah, as you can see, uh, I don't care what you came here for, but don't get in the way of my research. Uh, what is the research in this deep cave? Uh, there are always things to be researched everywhere. As the saying goes, ignorance is a researcher's disgrace. You must have noticed the huge ruin machine out there, right? That is actually a ring golem made in the ancient realm of Caria. In the local lexicon of Caria, uh, the name might possibly have, have been something like Mechanical Warden. That's a nice name. See, we are right behind the ring golem, the machine's operator. Uh, hang on, we went around. Is this the back of the head? Is that it? Should there. Uh, the machine's operator, should there have been one, would have entered from here. But a machine of this size would require more than one operator, right? Uh huh, that's among my research topics. Unfortunately, I haven't made much progress so far. Exploring the ring golem from the inside seems to be the only solution. I am, and I am presently looking for a way in. You sound more suspicious by the image. Well, not really. I think quite reasonable. That's right. We did meet in an absorber member disguised as a researcher that one time. Yeah. By my records, he was called Angel. Uh, and you can remember what happened to him again? We beat the snot out of him. Hey, hey, please don't. I am a legitimate researcher. Uh, you don't believe me, do you? So this, this is an investigation charter from the academia, with the highest possible level of clearance. There's not something to be given away on the streets. Certainly not one concerning investigations into ancient ruins as important as this. The academia would never issue something like this casually. Mm, this is such a large place, it look, and looks like a rare machinery. I expected the uh, research party to be more than one person. I can give you the original copy, but wait a second. Where did I put my camera? I remember placing inside my bag. Be careful, he's taking a suspicious machine out again. As I set the device carefully, it took the camera. Uh, is this the suspicious machine you mentioned? It's just a camera. Camera. That's right, it's a machine that takes pictures. It's pretty convenient. Yeah, the, this is a priceless item as far as the academy is concerned. I just can't let you touch it. Wait, who are you talking to just now? And uh, about that. A missionary friend? <laughs> She's been alone since she was little. Oh, so you often talk to yourself. Uh, well, I've heard of similar cases before. Don't worry, I understand your condition. It's okay, we're friendly people here in Sumeru. You have no trouble making real friends, I guarantee it. You still do not get in the way of my research. After all, nothing under the sun is truly new. 
and it is our duty as researchers to collect information and investigate it. Uh, all the characters uh, or the charters are recorded in the academia. If you are still skeptical, you just keep an image of this for validation in the house of data. Anyway, uh, we've got something to discuss. Uh, let's go over there. Let's wish. Some fate must have dictate, dictated that we would meet here. But that friend of yours, she must have led a lonely life. Be nice to her. Uh, anyway, I have to organize my findings. So if you would excuse me, where are we supposed to go to talk? My morning's friends. I reckon could be your friend. Me too. Uh, thanks, you too, but that's not the problem. The issue is that he can't see you, Arika. Uh huh. When Nara grew up, they can't really see our Nara anymore. Young Nara see us because they are innocent, but a grown Nara can't. Nara Inus is a dreamer, favored by tree and flower, so you can still see us, even as a grown up. Anyway, we should. Well, he's actually not that grow up. They keep mentioning how he isn't. He's underage to drink so far, so. At what age do you stop seeing our. 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 our Naras? Anyway, we should be more careful when talking to our Nara in front of others. Well, Paimon, don't think Chazari was lying anyway. You might have misunderstood him, Arika. Arika saw the Nara. Was taking out his camera and doing Kachik and Joe Hilinara. Very suspicious. If the Nara isn't bad, uh, he runs away every time the Hilinara come, so he can really be friends with the Hilinara. That sounds kind of sad. He must be quite a runner then. Uh, the Nara holds his machine and runs so fast. So he shouldn't be a bad person, nor should he be related to the children. At Vimar village. Uh, I'm not particularly interested in all this, but we'll finish while we started. I'm curious about the giant machine, actually. Yep, I'm on totally agrees. Anyway, since he's doing research around here, he should be pretty familiar with the situation. Maybe he can help you, Arika. Okay, any people? fly around with that. That's how he came here. Uh, finally believe me, do you? Yep, guess you're not suspicious after all, just are you? Uh, we have some questions about the situation. Uh, let's go in. As Kasharara, a researcher who specializes in studying ruined machines, I've been investigating this big guy over here for years. No one in, on this earth knows more about this ring golem than I do. What about beneath the earth then? Well, legends hold that ancient web of Kenya lies beneath the earth, since they built all the ring machines. It would be arrogant for me to say that I understand this device better than they do. Tell me about the <laughs> bad dirty stuff. Uh, you're looking for bad and dirty things, are you? Then you should visit the city. The city? Are bad things in the city? Um, this is just something I would say. Don't think too much about it. Anyway, this lookout is somewhat polluted, uh, which might be related to the bad and dirty stuff you mentioned. Uh, well, here's the situation. We've heard that the forest here has... You paraphrase our Rican's words. So that he understands. That's all. So let me think about this. I might indeed have some clues. According to my research, all ring mechanisms work on the same principle no matter what they do, whether it be flying or launching missiles. Uh, and well, a ring golem is theoretically the same as a ring guard, except that it was to be operated by people. Have you noticed anything normal about this ring golem? It looks incredibly big. Uh, it's I seem to be missing. Yeah, it's big guys. The no paper. Exactly. According to the documents, real machines are powered by the cars to 
be precise, by the dark power inside what you call an eye. Ah, oh, is that the dark power from the abyss or something? When Carrion was destroyed, many rain machines like this one burst out from the desert. From the desert? But didn't we saw Carrion ruins like in Mondstadt and on the chasm? Although things are different now, even the academia was unable to handle the course back then. A single mistake could cause a core meltdown, leading to a serious accident. As a result, the academia had no choice but to temporarily seal the cores and deal with them later. If the documents have it right, the core of this ring of Holland should be sealed inside the ancient ruins known as Death's Cavern. Which is right beneath our feet. Is there anything wrong with the car? Uh, there shouldn't be. But we have detected some energy leakage. The seal seems to have been damaged at some point. So we have no idea when. Uh, the last time someone published a research report regarding certain ma such matters was more than 10 years ago. Any progress on this matter should warrant a large amount of funding from the academia. Funny, are you saying that you get more from the, from the research? We know that. Uh, that's right, speaking of which, we did talk about pollution a moment ago. For ecological topics, we might be able to file a subject application with biology. Amurta. Come on, biology is quite a common word. What's Amurta? Is that supposed to be a made up, well, all words are made up, but uh, uh, that will really be an archal sign for those who study fringe subjects like us. At first, I had planned on taking the route recorded in previous reports to look inside. Ex unexpectedly, all the entrances were, were blocked. Arika knows the is the place outside where Arika sends bad things. Mm. I thought it might have been the Force Watchers or the Vimar villagers who did it, but given what you described, someone has have sneaked inside and blocked the entrance. Maybe it was the Manara's avatar that you mentioned. Well, I wouldn't dare mess with something like that. Hitchers are more than enough trouble for me, as you can see, or I wouldn't be stuck here right now. Oh, there are Hitchers around here. First things first of all, if you want to travel underground, I do have an idea as to how. Interested? This scenario is awesome, how do we travel beneath? These are pretty good after all, so how do we get down there? Just need to find a way to enter this ring golem and smash the block's entrance open with it. Oh, I just had a sense of deja vu. That's my kind of plane. The data acquired from such an action will be priceless, even if something goes wrong, <laughs> the benefits still outweigh the risks. Also, if we can investigate the core buried underground, I could submit a funny application on your behalf. What do you think? That's killing two birds with one stone? Well, three birds, actually. If we can get some funding, let's help Jazari out. Academic research is important too, after all. Of course, but you best report to the academia when you have the time, or this might be classified as malignant research. Well, um, yes, we've we've done some quests for the Knights of Avonius, so I should do some quests officially for the academia as well. Uh, let's try to get inside first. The operator might still be there. That would make for some great data, I mean, good research subject. Uh, it has been hundreds of years, you know? Never mind that. There might be treasure inside, right? I'm quite sure that some antiques are stored within. Research on those would... What do you think? Since Mr. Jazari has put it like that, Paimon reckons we should do some academic research. 
Great, so how do we get in? Uh -huh, I almost forgot the most important thing. Opening the door to the ring up on his cockpit requires an emit device. To put it simply, a key. Uh, the bad news is that I don't have this key. The good news is that I have discovered its whereabouts from studying the documents on it. If you must know, I have covered half of the as of Dina for a few records available. Uh, the last report on the Amity device was published decades ago. And so I have now figured it out, out. My findings cannot be published as things stay. Most irritating indeed. So exactly is the key. No, why can't you publish your results? It's because those big shots don't see the academic value in this. But isn't academic value just pompous human evalu evaluation, where they reduce knowledge down to mere practical tools? Knowledge itself cannot be determined to be more or less valuable. Uh, so where exactly is the key? You have mentioned it yet. Uh, to put it simply, the key may be found in Port Ormos to the south, uh, in the hands of an antique dealer named Roy. Roy Jan, Roy Nian, uh, Roy Nian, Roy Jan. I don't know. Could you please accompany me there? Uh -huh. You've been staying here doing research for so long, and you never thought about visiting him. Uh, the thing is, I'm not good at dealing with merchants. They just don't understand me, which makes communication almost impossible. Come on, you have a key. I wanna buy. How much? Uh, I've been cheated out of a lot of more before on account of this. Uh, that's true, I do find it hard to follow your thoughts at times too. That's the only option, he's been quite straightforward. Wait, so this is actually all my fault? Uh, well, whatever the case, we're going to put arms, right? Let's go check it out then. Ah yes, I am right behind its head now. Just a single one. Uh. <laughs> Can't see. Oh, come on, I just grabbed that. Where is it? Ah, there's one here as well. Let's do that. Hmm? 
Time to go. Time to go. A fateful offering. <laughs> and there's that as well. Let's go. Oh, he's dead. What shall we do? Gather! I'll uproot you! One with the forest! Order guide you! Solidify! Wind Strider! In shroud. As one with wind and cloud. Brings a smile to my face. In the other walls, in the other there. You know, I think I had seen a. Uh... I know here. Ah, hmm. oh. oh, but I think best for here. Yeah. It's maybe part of something else on the flash or accessible through something else. Time to go! Stabilize! One with the forest! God. Wind Strider! Can't see! Hmm. Why is there a chest here? Let's go in. Ah, quite next to the, to the porch.
boat this guy it looks expensive uh welcome you must be travelers from watch what brings you here to my shop would you like to make any purchases or seek to appraise any items uh, so you are Ronisia, uh, uh, the antique dealer, right? Ronisian chief antique appraiser, to be precise. Did you come specifically to visit me? Well, I shall let you down then. We're looking for a certain antique. Oh, then you've come to the right place. If you can name it, Ronisian, Roinjan. I think it's Ronyan. Ronyan. Roinian. It rolls easier on the tongue. Roinian. Uh, here can tell you about it. I've probably seen enough antiques to lay it out across an entire marketplace. Even the academia might not have seen quite as many. We're looking for the. What's the thing's name again? I'm okay to remember. Hi, we're looking for the Amity device. Huh? Never heard of something like that. Hey, you just said we could name anything. And don't worry, I haven't heard the name, but I might know of the thing you want. And Jake seems to have a variety of monikers, you see? Can you describe the thing that you are looking for? Uh, how should I put it? The documents didn't include a particularly detailed description. It's a... So how did you know he had it? It's an item in the style of those three machines, and it should be an edification device of sorts. It should be marked with a unique Kenya style patterns uh, that can be recognized to be chronologically different from the common types seen on ring guards, thus making this a, some sort of a earlier version of the device. And considering what we know of ring archaeology. Alright, you can stop now. I know what you're looking for. Ah, so you know. That's very helpful, thank you. In that case, please give it to me. Uh, that's not how this works. This item is very precious. Uh, if you really want it, you have to pay for it. And that's 500,000 more to be at the very least. I mean, I want to... In a game, I, in this game, I wouldn't spend this money on a quest item. But that seems like a reasonable price, considering the millions I spent just <laughs> leveling up. That's quite a unique item. It's an antique, you know. What I'm offering is pretty common price. Uh, but what if... The more is spent here can guarantee a successful report. Uh, let's just help him out, shall we? We help others bargain before, haven't we? We are probably a dead hand by now. Well, not really. I'm good at dealing with merchants. Well, uh, we could buy it for cheaper. If it works, we, we pay the full price because we'll result in a nice report. If it doesn't, we return for him and we be just our loss. You were useful anyway for us anyway, afterwards. Uh, well, not really. I'm gonna deal with merchants. Really, that's a relief. I'm terrible at things like this. Don't say that in front of the guy. That's everything to me. Just take it. I'll... I'll have to find a gig with the Eremite over there, if that's not sufficient, though. So. Um, oh, come on. Well, I kinda need that to complete the quest, don't I? That's the cheapest I can go. Okay, uh. <coughs> Halfway. Fine, I'll just make it do that amount, but treat it like the item, treat the item well, okay? Each antique has many stories and emotions behind it. Pretty good. Pretty good? That was good? I just went halfway to see what he would think. Well, here's the remaining funding. Uh, wait, what is this? 
Isn't this just a normal chaos core? Nonsense, that's no ordinary chaos core, but the core of a Rengard prototype found in Storm Tower's lair. That's not what we wanted, is it? I thought I had, I think I had one. See the marks left by the Great Wolf King up north? This is a unique treasure, alright? Yeah, make no mistake. Uh, then, isn't this the one we saw at Storm Tower's lair? Didn't they take it? This one's got to be a fake. And uh, chicks are so for their stories. Oh, that's impressive understanding for someone your age. Not really, we were there, we just said. Wait, but that's not the point. Well, I don't know about this dang fellow, but I sure have heard of Storm Terror's lair. Anyway, if you have different insights about antiques, we could discuss them in private. Whatever this is, it's definitely not the amazing device. And shouldn't we have... Did we pay him already? Shouldn't we see the thing before paying? What I'm looking for is... Is... Is a key that can open the ring golem on the Vantaka mountain. According to my research, it should be in the hands of your great father, Mr. Hassan, the golden adventurer. Golden adventurer? Like a golden era? Well, at least that was the case several decades ago. As I describes the story to me of Mr. Hassan, blah, blah blah. Oh, come on. You should have just said this earlier. You didn't exactly let me. Um, but that really brings back memories. It's been so long since I last heard stories about my grandpa. When I was little, grandpa would often tell me stories of his adventures. I thought then that he was just bragging, but what do you know? He actually was that awesome. Speaking of which, it is mostly because of him that I became an appraiser of antiques. All the stories about treasure were just so intriguing. Still, the thing you spoke of is not here with me. Uh, so, you haven't sold it off, have you? I wish I did, but treasures don't stay where they don't belong, as they say. I mean, isn't that what happens in all treasure hunting legends? Well, Grandpa didn't care about any of that stuff, but according to him, the device engraved with ancient characters was lost during one of his adventures in some underground cave. Why would you bring a device you didn't care about, but that was rare, along with you in your adventures? I mean, I'm doing that, but I don't exactly have a chest on my house to keep them. That was a long story, one which he told me many times, but I can't remember a single word of it now. Actually, I even planned to treasure hunt for it with some others back then. And as the weather the we really as to where we really found it again, well if we did it should still be hidden in a secret base at Vimara Village. A secret base at Vimara Village. Did you grow up in Vimara Village too? Uh, I always went there to play when I was a kid. You know how kids love their secret bases. Can you please so show us to the secret base? Perhaps we could find some clues there. So this thing is that important to you? Mm. Still, I haven't been back there for over 10 years. It's important matter pertaining to scientific research. <laughs> it's important matter pertaining to more scientific research. Alright, since you brought something from me, uh, I'll take you there, but try to manage your expectations, okay? I can't really remember what happened that long ago. We're calling on you either way. Uh, where are to the secret base we go? Well, they're saying something. Go on. I got first things, I can follow you. It's not important, is it? Speak to yourself again, poor kid. Uh, um. No, it's not here. Huh? Ah, I got that. No, uh.
No, I j didn't just see the money. No, it's not here. I'm still keeping the one. I want to keep that. This new coin box. This scenery is wonderful. Time to go. <laughs> oh, hang on, this guy knows that. Should go. Runner, runner will be fine. We can work for it. You know, she's just suspend animation indefinitely until I finish those quests. Should be in a cave somewhere near here. Is my memory going or something? Right on west, the villagers of the Mara village. They should know if there is a cave around here. The villagers, there's no point asking them. This is a secret base. How would they even know where it is? If I remember correctly, the cave entrance should be behind this vine. So let's split up and search for it. This great researcher and I will go look over there. You choose search this place, alright? Alrighty, then let's start our search from the vines here. Uh, there really are so many of them though. These are not vines, they are Vamada. Uh, you know something about this, or you, you can? Yes, these are Vamada, are an Ara maiden. Why would Anara make this? Anara make Vamada when they don't want Nara to enter a place where Vamada are present, only Anara can enter. Uh, Anara are pretty small, but the place being blocked completely. Vamal thinks even you can get through. Nara can get in, but Anara can sing. Vamada is pain when they hear us singing. And when they do, we can enter. Nice thing, like a ball, like a sonic. Yep, Nara is a friend of the forest. If you sing, Nara ignores the Vamanda will hear it. Come, our can will teach you. Okay. I thought it was the song, as the boy sure plays the song, and then switch to activate the banana. No kidding, it really starts spinning like a ball. And there's our mysterious cave entrance. Arika remembers this cave. And did you make this Vamanda, Arika? Arika don't, doesn't remember, but little Nara must be protected. This much Arika knows. Well, there's no clue why this place was sealed by the Arnara, but this should be the entrance to the secret base, so let's call those two over. Ah, uh, I knew this was the place. Our secret base should be this way. How did you guys find it? Arikan did a great job. Uh, either way, since you found the entrance to the cave, let's go in. We just had to find the emitted device next. It's pretty big inside, don't get scared now. Ooh.
Ah, oh, this place is really huge. You are a pretty impressive kid, yeah? Rani... Ranian... Rainia. Not bad, yeah? But my... It's much smaller than I remember. That's because you've grown up. I'm more than grown up. I'm an old man now. But this place really hasn't changed at all. It's like it times to still here. Even the air smells the same. A single whiff brings back so many memories. That's not waste time. <laughs> Come on. Um, uh, do you remember where the Amit advice is? Patience, youngster. Let's take a look around first. One thing has been bugging Paimon since we first walked in. What is this huge machine part? Oh, Arika knows. This was moved here from the giant air mountain. Yeah, our mountain that you mean that was taken from the ring going from before? You'll notice too, judging from the pattern, such parts should belong to the ring going, so I don't know why it was arranged in this fashion. Perhaps you really do have some academic talent. Would you like me to recommend you to study in the academia once our project comes to a close? You're sure to make lots of friends there. Uh, that's not what this is about, but thanks anyway. But a child shouldn't have been able to move anything this big. So, who piled up here in this way? Maybe it was a first spirit? Nah, no, just kidding. I can remember. Arika knows. Arika moved it. How did you move something this big? Arika can move it. Arika is very strong. Uh, I remember two groups of us kids running around this big guy in play fighting. Uh, were, were there that many children here before? In the beginning, yes, our group's stronghold should be up ahead. No, I remember now. I think I burned something over there. I'll take you. I'm not really sure why I have to use those. Time to go. Come on, come on, I want to see what I've got. And it's just a booklet. Oh, this is good stuff. This was our adventure handbook back in the day. Adventure handbook? Don't you guys know about adventure handbooks? I thought we were adventures from a broad base on how you look and the fact that you are here looking for a treasure or something. Yes, I did in fact get an adventure handbook. Right? Many adventures write on them. Uh, it's like an adventure journal to record their experiences, plans, and even the clues to treasure locations. Uh, as you guys know, my grandfather was a great adventurer, though I didn't understand a lick of what he wrote into the, his adventure journal. Still, I grew up wanting to be an adventurer, so I made my own imitation adventure handbook. You could say that that's where I got my start. I know how important this is to you, but it won't help us find the thing we are looking for. No, no, not so fast. Didn't I tell you that I plan to find the amazing device? What happened then is recorded in this adventure handbook. Let me see. I remember that the two of us... Wait a moment. Why are there three people in the drawing? Has my memory already gone that bad? 
or is it because my eyes can see well anymore? Do you need me to lend you my glasses? No. I have the latest model as produced by the academia and it just all purposes for any person. Sir researcher, are you really that? Forget it. Let me take a closer look. I'm pretty sure now that the image device should have been buried right here by yours truly. Great, so we just have to search this cave, is, is what I would say, if this place wasn't quite so big. Uh, there's no need for that, the location of the device is recorded here, it should be. Oh, okay. But I, it's here, but I can't read it. Time to go. Yes, this is indeed the meter device. What does it look like? See, I didn't lie to you guys. Yay, now we can scuttle right back and open the giant robot up, right? I almost got excited already. Alas, this is just a fragment. There's no way we will open the ring guard golem without the complete device. I can fix it if it's not being completely destroyed. But we'll have to find some way to recover the remaining pieces. And as for the remaining fragments... Oh, don't be so anxious, the device will split into three parts. But why would Grandpa put them in three different locations? Mm, you know what? This would be a very exciting story, if only I remembered more of it. Three different piece places, so are the locations of the fragments recorded here? Yes, that's right. The locations of the bird device fragments are all recorded in this handbook. We must have found the fragment bird here back then from wherever it was at first. In that case, let's go find the remaining two fragments using this. We're the best of, we're the best at finding things, aren't we? Yeah, pretty good at finding things, but as for people, yeah. Uh, yeah, Paimono was what you mean. It's alright, so we'll surely find her. Uh, that's what I said anyway, but... But... I can't understand these writings. Uh, how can that be? Did you write these notes yourself? Well, this is actually a record of an adventure that the two, maybe the three of us undertook. I can't remember uh, who this third person was, but I certainly haven't forgotten the old man. If you want to know the location of the fragment, of the remaining device, fragments, you should go look for him. Uh, hang on. Uh, okay, the picture isn't of an old man. He's an old man now. That old man should still be kicking even now. And if he is, he definitely still lives in Vimar village. He did say he will live all the rest of his days there, after all. The old man you're talking about is... Amandaya, maybe? Oh, so you know that old fellow. Well, that makes things easier. Take this handbook and show it to him. He should understand. Uh, aren't you gonna come with us? Uh, I don't want to meet that old fossil. If you figure out where the fragments are buried, go look for them yourself. I would like to go with you, but my old bones aren't up to the test anymore. I wanted to be a great adventurer like my grandfather back when I was a young boy, and if I hadn't been, if hadn't been for that guy, well, stories are in the end more important than the adventure itself. So if you collect any stories, please remember to bring them to me. We can give you guys this device fragment as a reward. How about it? It's a good deal, right? It's not like we have any other option. Well, it looks like I won't be of much help in these endeavors, so I might as well wait here for you. There are lots of parts here to study, and I'm not going to pass up the chance to do it. 
Recording the two of you to bring the fragments back as quickly as quickly as you can. Things will get dicey for me if I miss the deadline. Time to go. There's no Oh, I see. Come on. Expect that we are ring golem components that I've never seen before. How much more of this ring golem have I not discovered? Have you found the fragments of the Amity device? My academic career is in your hands here. Well, <laughs> we didn't ask our Rican why he moved that. Time to go. Time to go. Ah, oh, we meet again, friends of Ranan. Is she now with you? I wonder what's taking her so long to patrol the woods this time. Still, this must be a special occasion for you to come see me. Well, it's for... It's over there about Rhenian, the secret base, the hidden book, the story, lots of twists. Ah, so when should the secret base? What do you think? Pretty impressive, isn't it? Rhenian is here in Vimara and still doesn't want to see me. That fellow gets more stubborn the older he gets. That's how he is, though. It's almost been 10 years since I last saw him. Uh, and that was when I had some business on Port Ormos. I'm relieved to hear he's still himself. That's an our relationship you have between you. Uh, so why doesn't Roy Yang want to see you? It's a long story. I... You shouldn't mind hearing an old man's prattle on, would you? Well, the guy won the... Quest, the story. Songs don't go all for too long. I'm quite curious, actually. Yes, Pamela's much to know too. Back when we were kids, Ronyan lived in Vimara for a while because of his grandfather. As a kid burst from bursting for almost with legendary adventure for his grandfather, Ronyan quickly drew the attention of the other kids. I was one of those kids who was fascinated by the stories we heard from his grandfather. Together, we built a secret base in a cave and dressed ourselves as, up as warriors and heroes with branches and flowers. To us children, the base was another world where we went through countless imaginary adventures. Those old times seem like a dream now. Ryan also mentioned that the base once played host to, lo to loads of kids, so what happened? All kids grow up eventually. Yeah, uh, kids do have short attention spans in the case. Uh, be it legends or adventures, these are just some of their many passing interests. By the time we realized that truth, Ronyan and I were the only two left in the base. No, make that three actually. Ronyan also mentioned there were three of you, but he can't recall the third person anymore. I'm not sure either. It's been so long when we've both, we're both old now. Who could it have been? Aranara, perhaps? This Aranara again? Now, that sounds like make-believe worthy of children. It, 
If I had left Vimara with him, I probably still believe in all that. Huh? No. Why? With him, you say, so why did Ryan leave then? For his adventures, of course. That guy is being stubborn ever since we were kids. With Val to become the greatest adventurers in the world, just like his legendary grandfather. But neither of us had the knack for being one. After my initial enthusiasm had worn off, I found that I had far more important things to do. So in the end, uh, he was the last, last one left. That's why we're like this now. And the, the way he says it, I was more of an adventurer, yet I gave up before he did. Stubbornness, that's all it is. Still, it was also thanks to Ryan's stubbornness that he wound up being the best antique dealer in Port Ormos. Well, that's it for the story. You want to know where to find the two fragments, right? It's going to take a while to mark them out for you, though my eyesight is gotten quite the problem in my old age. I'll count this as a commission from him. I use traditional Vimara cursive for this, which he should be able to comprehend. He definitely would have he definitely would have back then anyway. And based on those both fragments using the handbook as reference. It's done, just follow the instructions and you'll be alright. To be honest, I never thought that this thing would still have its use after all these years. Ah yes, I just found this in the journal too. Grandpa Mandaya picks a dry flower from the yellow sheets. Give this to Ryan when when you see him again. Maybe this will jack his memory a bit. Uh, why didn't you say anything back there, Arika? Amanda is good Nara. You have nothing to fear. Arika wasn't afraid. Arika has heard of the things you talked about earlier. And they are very familiar, just can remember them. And so he was the third one. Arika was confused, so Arika didn't say anything. That's why a strange problem, Arika. Yes, yeah, very strange. This is tiring, but at least we are making progress. Anyway, let's do what Amadaya said and go find the two fragments. Then give them to Jazari. Uh, what am I supposed to? Oh, okay, there are three things. Hmm. Uh, this one is down there. Oh, there's one here. That one's new. I don't remember that. get down there. Hmm, 
me with that. So where are you going? Ah, here. Stay close and you will live. Who says there aren't benefits to a life of wandering? Follow the wind. And shattered. Sh 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 Clouds high. The birds swarm with the forest. I hear everything. Shine down. Sh 
Is there a chest here? Uh, let's check up here. Wind Strider. Looks like uh, there, there are big robot parts here too. Jay, imagine what would happen if Jazar saw them. He would whip his camera out again and that would be the last we hear of him for a while. Dorica claims to have moved the components back there, but that can't be true, right? Of course it is true, Arikan doesn't see Nara. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, Arika was the Nara who played with the kids at the secret base. But Arika remembers nothing about this. Do Aranara forget the past too? The Forge remembers everything. Arika doesn't know what you're talking about, but and Arika can remember. But it's fun hanging around with little Nara. Paimon hopes you remain happy wherever you may go, Arika. Just like this thing can be combined with the one with the cup there. There should be some other way to protect the sites. There may be, but I don't really you know. What's our objective? Okay, let's heal him. It's mostly so he doesn't keep killing himself. Uh, many of those. Walk wood. I will have order. Let's nip that in the butt. As one with wind and cloud, wind strike. Right this on your side. One with the forest. Wind Strider! Come 
Huh? It's taking longer than. There's music coming from somewhere. Oh, there's an art nearby. Oh, there's one here. That underground or not? This one is... Time to go. Hmm. Ah, here. Look, the plane's here. What inside the cave wouldn't have it to be? Marana. Oh, it's Marana. Please protect our recon, our eggs. We will protect you. No need to be afraid of Marana, our recon. If Madaya is right, the fragment of the Amity device should be inside. Let's neutralize the recon first. Sure, sure. Solidify. Where's the keep up? And now, stabilize. One with the forest. Clouds high. The birds. Done. Okay, not speaking. Brings a smile to my face. That's the last framing. Now we have them all. Pick to Jazari and stuff. Time to go. Nothing 
Sound yeah. Around here a bit faster, flying in there. Time to go. Time to go. Ah, oh, he's here still. I thought he went back to Port Palmos. I follow the wind. So I'll talk to the other guy, not you. Ah, uh, hang on, do I have all the pieces here in my inventory? Uh, 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 um, that's what I... Mm. Ah, okay, that's how the key would be. Yeah. Hey, Orinia, we're back. There you are, looks like you met the old man and found the fragments you were looking for. Uh, that aside, is he as tedious now as he was then? Not that I care though. Uh, you two are so alike. Uh, what did Amadai tell you? Don't believe anything he said. If he hadn't slipped back into the village the night before a rich major at sea, we could have been the greatest adventurers in history. It doesn't sound very likely. Come on, I'm just kidding. I'm very suited to dealing with antiques. Uh, even a great adventurer like my grandfather eventually went missing in the adventures. I doubt I would have stood much of chains. For me, I'd be satisfied as so long as there's a story to hear. So what stories have you collected? According to our deal, the device fragments in our hands were meant to be exchanged for stories. Uh, about the Inanda's device in the Wittering. Mm, in the device. No, about the fairies and the children. The Orion about the adventure, the Arnara and the children. Fairies in the forest. I've heard similar legends before, but your tale is a particularly interesting one. That's a good enough start for me. The fragments are yours, as you we agreed. Uh, I could tell. I wanted to tell both stories to him. It's two fragments, two stories. Take them to your to our great researcher. He's been stressing out this entire time while you were all having fun. I should get back to my shop now. I'll be quite upset if I miss out on a big sale. Wait a second. I have something else. We have to do that flower. Uh, Amadai wanted you to have this flower. Seriously, at this age, hold on. I think I remember this. Have you recall anything? Uh, maybe, but then again, maybe not. Anyway, the past should stay in the past, so forget it. But I have a feeling this flower does not belong to me, so please return it to where it belongs. I can tell you that it. You can see things I can't. He seems to have become a bit more fun than before. <coughs> Do drop in my shop when you get the chance. Until then, farewell. Where it belongs, the floor is yours, Aurigan. 
As far as precious, why give to Arika? Because it belongs to you. Arika doesn't remember the flower, but Arika likes it. Arika cherishes this flower. Arika shall plant it in the garden. Isn't this a dry in between the book? We'll see you at the foot of the Great Arrow Mountain. Once we get the giant machine started, we'll go get the bad guys together. Yes, Arika wants to fight the bad guys with you. That's a promise, Arika. What about this here? There is usually a puzzle next to those. But I... I don't think I figure out anything else here. Thank goodness you're back. Here are the two remaining fragments. Ah yes, that's them. Alright. Uh, thank you so much for your help. I'll take care of the rest. Just I fixed the Amity device. Well, this should do the trick. Uh-huh, pretty good, huh? Why, I bet that even... Uh, her badge of the academia couldn't fix this thing without consulting any information. It looks pretty straightforward. You're lucky to have me with you, you know? Now we can get inside the ring golem. I think that's our line. Uh, no one's been in this machine for centuries. I can already smell the parchment of the pages in the academic annals that shall bear my name. Oh, well, sorry, I got you excited. Uh, no problem, uh, Pamela's getting excited too. Mora, our treasure, here we come. Same. Treasure usually converted or mo in Mora, or Mora usually converted in treasure. Hmm. Another TARDIS. Mm, it looks just like the big rocket by Mons Vistage. So is this quest supposed to be unlocked after that one? Oh, you've been inside an wing Colin. Yes, in the desert. Someone named Afrato asked us to look into machines just like this one. A front darn don't tell me he also got his eyes on the title of well known Ringolic researcher. Oh no, no, I don't think that's the case. I remember the guy to be a Vahumana researcher, and this shouldn't interest him. That's not totally impossible though. After all, that's where Iskandar the sage saying behold. The thousand years history of ancient Kenya lies before us comes from. And that's about the well-known researcher thing. Compared to the one we saw, this seems really deserted. That was deserted. No, there were some fungi around, but it's deserted. Of course, but considering her talents in the performing arts, I believe we might need to pay to see her performance next time. Hmm? According to the text named the review of research on issues related to the ring golem in ancient Kenya, the last scholar who managed to get inside a ring golem <coughs> for systematic research was Pir Kavikavus. <coughs> I'm sure you don't know this, but Pir Kavikavus was one of the greatest scholars in Kishamrei War's history. Kafkavus earned the rank of Herbert before hitting 30, a genuine academic genius. With his achievements, he would have become a sage sooner or later, but he met with an accident during an expedition and his research results were lost. Ever since then, Kishamrei War uh, has gone downhill. 
If he had lived longer, perhaps I wouldn't be worrying about expenses day and night like this. By the way, it's my academic ambition to follow in Pir Kafkaus footsteps. Well, so the next step should be smash open the entrance. Uh -huh. Then we need to activate the big guy first. Right, by activating the ring golem, I can get valuable experimental data, which will then serve as the basis for a breakthrough in my research. One has to make some waves to outdo one's predecessors after all. So we start these big guys from the steering cabin, right? Well, generally, once the separation valve is in the steering cabin is turned on, the ruin golem should be activated. But I was told, but as I told you before, all ring machines are driven by dark power of their cores, and the cores of the ring golem have been sealed underground. Even if we got into the steering cabin, the conventional method will not work. In fact, we can't even start the lift right now before us. So, how will we get to the steering cabin at the top? Uh, you're right, what do we do now? Let's try hitting it. Uh, we're implying there's an unconventional route. Uh, at the same goes, when one door closes, another opens. In any case, I'm positive that the people of Kenya surely took this scenario in consideration. The academia's research shows that uh, the early re machines also had a backup power system, perhaps because the techniques that allowed them to utilize this arc power were still in their infancy. Uh, power system. Unlike the cores that supply, al that supply almost unlimited energy, this power supply comprises a series of small power relays. The power sources from these devices are energy blocks that store pure energy extracted from the ley lines. According to Vahumana researchers, ideology, uh, this power system most likely had been in widespread use before, long before the first ring machine was ever built in ancient Kenya. As I stated earlier, the ring golem is an earlier mo early model, so it must have one of those backup power systems. Or something this big. I mean, yeah, something this large is an early model to a ring guard. The core power cabin is at the bottom. Let's get down there first. Time to go. Can I enter these rooms? Solidify. Wind strider. In shroud. I hear everything! One with the forest! Uh, do I choose electricity? Uh, I'm not really sure why these energy cubes were left all over. Oh, it's starting up. How do you think the machinery in the green Golem, whether it's a relay or a trapdoor, can be powered by this energy block? The Nazi seems to have changed at all. No, that's because the system comprises of a series of small power relays. In order, in other words, we have to work with our our way up from the bottom, and the system can only function when all the relays have been connected, all of them. 
Give the, given the damage to the Ringolan, it will be quite difficult for it to run at full power. But just as you were activating this relay, I found this in the power room. It seems to be the blueprint of the Ringolan. Perhaps it's maintenance crew left here. According to this blueprint, we only need to connect several keys, key relays to start this machine. At the very least, we'll be able to start this lift and go up the steering cabin. That sounds questionable. Well, there's something else. There's nothing else we can do, so we might as well try to activate the lift first. Yes. Wait, aren't you coming with us? I'll stay here and take picture. No, study the internal structure of the ring god. That's also important work. Besides, I'm a scholar. There's little I could do to assist you directly in your task. But if you have any technical problems, I'll be here for you. Okay, I got it. Get the battery placed on the machine. Look at the ingenious machinery around. What a masterpiece of human civilization. This is valuable information for research. I've got to record it all down. There's something here. Ancient work log. The energy cores have stopped working. The cause is an inherent mechanical design defect that causes the occasional operation of overload. Suggest a solution due to the lack of spare parts and the difficulty of producing more. Maintenance is incomplete. It can only be operated at full power for a short, for a short while. Shutdown is recommended each time the chronometer completes one rotation. The weapon systems have melted down to, due to overuse. Suggest a solution. Strip destroy machinery for related parts. And then reassemble for use. Testing indicates that this should basically be able to fulfill the requirements of high intensity combat. Smart boot system failed, cause unknown. Many components have taken on sand or have disintegrated. The mobility system has not been completely disabled, but the ability to walk long distance has been lost. Such a solution, this machine was lost in the southern desert. Uh, we lack the means to tow this machine, thus it can only stand by and await retrieval. It isn't in the desert. Back so soon? Well, I'm still studying the load-bearing structure of these components here, but it's impressive that you got the lift started. We were just guessing about the activation thing, weren't you? Well, come on, I've only read about it in books. Just so you know, there are no more than three people in the entire, entire academia who can read this blueprint, so guessing you right does mean something. Anyway, now that the lift is working, we should be able to access the steering room above by activating the relays on the middle level. I see, the middle level gear should be in the power room. We need to activate all four relay units. Uh, if you can find an energy block that works, uh, it is also possible to temporarily remove them from the device. Uh, it's fine as long as they are all connected in the end. I'll keep waiting for you here then. Hmm. 
they just took a way long time to activate. But I don't really have more do I? Uh, two places. Okay, I was just testing. See what could work could happen. Mm, hang on, let me just mark the one I just grabbed. Mm, Hildrick. Schwa name Rita. Beard father. Passed away due to multiple organ failure. May he rest in peace in the far land. Oh, tree here. Saint of the Golden Hall. Ah, that's like uh, the role in the their rank in the army or something. Shu Shuarin Nemrita. Executed by the Knight Marshal on Fortas for betrayal that caused irreversible damage to a machine. Despite the major loss and that the Knight Marshal's left eye was lost in the US event, Given Hadura was the last of their compatriots, a proper knight's funeral was granted for Hadura. Someone's over there. Oh, who was it? Stabilize! This is order! Fallen leaves! Adorn my- Wind strike! Just like we rehearsed! Let's nip that in the butt! Wind strike in shroud as one with wind and cloud. Kick, kick. 
Oh, I find more stuff. Come on. Solidify. Can't see. I'll uproot you. Gather. Wind strike. Alright, done. Time to go. Huh? Ah, everything is open now. Time to go. Stairs making me upwards. Time to go. Uh, go to the top level. Zandik's note, a page from the research notes, but it seems to have been torn off and hidden here by the author. Collected a lot of components, the spare parts of the huge machine, if only could figure out its working principle and manufacturing process. Fiddling with these components almost caused a delay in my work. These exquisite mechanical parts have a unique and ingenious style, which not only is not only likely is not which is not likely to be found in handcrafted artifacts under the rule of archons. I am going to take them apart and record the size and shape one by one. But first of all, this secret must not be revealed to the other team members. Time to go. Damn, it's all closed. Ah, uh, I have to. No, I. Uh, where do I grab one? Deactivate those can. No. Can I talk to the guy here about the enemy just ah I had to talk to you again. Okay. Uh what are you guys doing up here up there? I thought I heard truly incredible racket while I was studying this inductive circuit. Well, whatever you're doing, please skip down. <laughs> if there's any trouble with the machine here, it'll be hard for me to explain it all in my in any way in my report to the academia. You met the pilot? Pilot, are you joking? Even people of Kenya couldn't live for hundreds of years. Well, I don't say he's alive. Uh, anyway, I assume you've got the relays in the middle connected, yes? Uh, I'm almost done here as well. Come, let's go up to the steering cabin at the top. Just like before, we simply need to connect the power supply to the power system to the steering cabin to activate the Ringolens control systems. Uh, 
Um. No, there's better. Isn't the school shopping that? Ah, oh, no, look here it is. Who says there aren't benefits to a life of wandering? When missing in the battle against the onslaught, onslaught of dark beasts, only her and her ancient ring were recovered. Uh, a proper knight's funeral was arranged for her. Why do people of Kenya seem to have German names? Like the people of most times. Um, says it's dark stones late. Nothing else here seems to be of value. Stones late? Don't underestimate it. If we if can get the control system running, then we can see the outside world through it. Yeah, we, we used that. She said we went inside the one in the desert. The control system here looks like it can still work. Ancient Kenya's creations really are amazing. I never thought I would have this change in, my, in this lifetime, but now it seems that once I complete this research report, winning the, winning the Peer Kavikavus Prize is only a matter of time now. Then let's try and start this machine. Paimon can wait. Time is a wasting. No, no, we shouldn't rush anything. We need to follow the instructions. Instructions. Who reads instructions? Uh, let me see. According to the specifications, I should first press. Uh, which one is it? The big red button labeled "Don't push it." That's the one you want to test first. Oh, I can't aim there. I thought that's what I was about to break. I should have checked if I knew that was... Ah, okay, it's on the same spot. Okay. I wanted to check the map before and after when it's the same spot. Hey, did you break it? Uh, what did I say about following the instructions? We didn't really get to do anything. Uh, it's arm just, you know, fell off. But I'm almost pretty sure the machine itself is to blame. Fine, I'll record it as an experimental accident then. Uh, I do hope that this won't diminish my reporting in any way. 
You can file a complaint about us, we don't care. Anyway, it seems like we won't be able to start the ring calling again, so there's no point in me keeping you here. I know they're here to investigate the contamination of the underground ruins, but I'm afraid that the ring golem won't be much use to you now. Even so, you may you may see some unexpected progress as a result of what you did. Well, I shall not keep you any longer. I have my research to get done here in any case. You can come and look for me once your work's done, if I haven't been sampling by first trying the ring golem yet. Uh, once that happens, I can help you apply for the research project on the Chaos Course. I'll be the one in charge of the projects, of course, but don't worry, I'll give you half of the fun. Thanks. Uh, anyone can embark on an academic career as long as they have the desire to learn, so go for it. And they just gain the way of themselves. The gates to scholarship will open to whoever has seeking hearts. Now go for it with that knight. Where's the displacing? Oh, we can leave from here. Oh, I think this was close. Uh, what are you doing here? Arika has been waiting for you here since Arika finished sowing the flowers. But then something just fell off the great iron mountain. It almost hit Arika. Oh no, we're sorry, Arika. Hammond doesn't have to be sorry. Arika is fine. Arika is a fast runner, so Arika didn't get hit. Just glad it didn't hurt you. The robot severed arm must have broken the entrance to the. It's not severed. To the underground rings open. Uh, well, at least it wasn't completely useless. Then let's go down and have a look. Who knows what nasty things wait for us down there. Are we going with you? Uh, the only thing in there must be the ring golems. Uh, chaos core, you know, the one Chazari talked about. 
It's sealed by branches and vines, but something seems to be flowing out of it. Oh, it's the filthy stuff. Oh, uh, you can feel it. This is what made the forest sick. Ah, uh, some of mages seem to be up to something around those big branches. This can't be good. If I remember, Jazari said that the core seal had been damaged. Maybe the abyss, this abyss mages had something to do with it. Anyway, you should go and find a place to hide, Arika. Let's stop them. Stabilize! One with the forest! Keep up! I hear everything! Call it Amber! Help! Hi! Quake! Clouds high! The birds? Can't see! The signs of the branch is strong, so I'm supposed to have some to do it. Let's get rid of the rest of the experiences. Okay, so no puzzle or anything. Just murder everybody around and we'll be fine. Follow the wind. Uh, this looks like an exit. Time to go. No, blocked. Oh no, this looks like the kind of place there should be a Abyss Heroes behind the whole plan. I follow the wind. Start the seal. The things are still coming out of it. Let's take a closer look at it. Time to go. Huh. Come on down there. Okay, 
It doesn't look safe. It's probably radioactive. Yeah. Oh, come on, I just... Why not fight there? I was just here. Behold! One with nature! The abyss! This is order! Stabilize! Hear the truth! I'll approve the gifts of grace! Peace be with you! Fight this on the side! Fallen leaves, adorn my knights! Hear the truth! Solidify! The gifts! Of grace. In the name of the truth. Wind strike. Let's nip that in the butt. Go. I will have order. Stabilize. I hear everything. One with the forest. The truth yeah. shall endure. Fair enough. like an off switch there and it's all the fun free uh first you're gonna slowly take care of the better right leave the new one rooms now uh, through here now keep up Nip that in the butt. Gather. Wind strider. One with the forest. Help. I'll uproot you. In shroud! Yeah. Time to go! <laughs> Brings a smile to my face. Uh. 
Oh, I see. Time to go. Hell, fancy is finally over. Well, it was a long journey, wasn't it? Let's go to start to Shazari. Let's the start to Grandpa Hoinia. Yeah, in Grandpa Hoinia's day, what an interesting story. Who know that we actually saved the forest? Uh, anyway, we don't know what Marana's avatar has to do with the his order yet, but it's a good thing that we cured the forest illness of the same. Thank you for helping our current. You're welcome. So, what do you plan to do next, our Arikan? Our Arikan will celebrate first of all Sava, but our Arikan worries about the forest's illness. There's a chance that the bad things that made the forest sick will come back. Our Arikan needs to guard the forest. See, since he's going to face old Sava, I thought this quest was supposed to come before the desert. So, our Arikan will come back here after face old Sava. Oh, Nara really do have tough jobs. If you ever need your help, need any help, or you can be sure to come to us. Okay, or you can will take care of yourself. We'll see each other soon. Wow, yeah, I'm glad I didn't start this quest last time because it sure took a long time. Hmm, where's that. Ah, leaves. Hmm. Good negotiation teams entering report. Someone seems to have burned the contents in a hurry. Only a few words remain legible now. From a large group of Mechanisms similar to the huge walking machinery we previously found at the ruins of Gurabat. After a preliminary investigation, I reckon that they are from the same era. The key parts missing in the Gurabat symbols, excuse me for the rash name, have been found here. Uh, it may be possible to repair the machinery's automatic system. Found an organization called Shuarnamrita, and its existence may be confirmed by the legend of ruins of Tari. Recorder Trinita Duster Zendik. Where am I? Those guys there? Ah, uh, that's how they were. Uh. Enough. You 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 ah, I the birds come. <laughs> Can't see. Don't be a killjoy. <laughs> I will have order. Gather Just like I went too far. One with the forest. Yeah. You need to hurry up. God. I hear everything. This was well done. In shroud. You want this one? Break this on for size. Wind strike. Damn. This is holding it. The king. Left, right. Come on, Fortunate uh, what does I have here? It's probably just something here, yeah. And... Quests, quests. Upon the slumber, lost the same, our village... Merchant from Mostar. Ah, yeah, that was the one that... Catherine told me about. Okay, yeah, and I can probably do... The quest, the event quest. Next Wherever time, in this world. Let me suppose it's one more day for the last one to unlock. So, yes. Mm -hmm. 
It's complete. Just open, but I still gotta do Tainaris. I haven't. Uh, this is just a new area. I have for this one, but okay. But all right. I carry memories of my home. Uh, what I was going to do as quest here is done. Uh, that's some point. Is this above ground? I don't think I fought that. I don't remember seeing that. I think it was at an hour with the desert. Or during this quest. So let me check it. Time to go. Yeah, uh, maybe it's there. Uh, no. <laughs> it be. It's always an arena. <laughs> it may be underground. This. Uh. Oh, damn. Oh, no, I can I? No. a smile to my face. Stabilize! Fallen leaves. Adorn my n- One with the forest. God! Let's nip that in the butt. Time to go. Solidify. Order guide you. In shroud. I'll uproot you. Wind strider. As one with wind and cloud. One with the forest. Yeah. Ha. Keep up. Uh, and there's a chest here. What? Are you the guy guarding the chest? In shroud. This is order. Wind strider. Clouds high. The birds. I hear everything. Can't see. Just like we heard. Solidify. Hmm. Why is there a chest here? All right, let's continue. Uh, 
the chapters in your boss. <laughs> Maybe it is accessible for me. Time to go. Uh, no, it isn't. Uh, so it's probably from here. Elsewhere. Yeah, now I'm going towards the uh, I think there's one up there. Oh, it's horrible to find stuff. There it is. Follow the wind. getting stuck. Time to go. <laughs> Time to go. Stabilize. But I think that's outside. Huh? I didn't catch that already. Plus, watching the Vantaka and the Children Archive. <laughs> Time to go. I follow the wind. Yeah. 
Ma'am, stop sliding down. Mm. Uh, I guess through here. Going downwards from there. Time to go. that teleport already was this area not here before don't even remember seeing that on the map Solidify. probably would be Eon Blight Drake It looks like it's a mixture of the two drinks. As one with wind and cloud. Gather. One with the forest. Let's nip that in the butt. Wind strider. Stabilize. I will have order. <laughs> Can't see. Because just because he used the that skill that attack was one four taking off from the sky and a single challenge a single challenge to involve the attack by attacking the car on its head a single challenge but. It's a single action. You obviously will be in a single challenge. But all right. I guess I'll stop here. Continuing with Link's Awakening tomorrow, and then some other day of the week, I'll do the event quests. 
here on Genshin.